Coming soon on Sydney's Super Tunnel. This is by far and away the biggest public transport project in Australia's history. People often would warn you don't do a curved cable state bridge and people will often warn you don't do a cable state rail bridge. But we had both. I've seen how other conventional railways work and coming onto this project, it just blows my mind. I'm absolutely stoked with the result. One of the things I really love about this view, in a sense, captures the essence of the project. What do you mean by um, bubbles? The bubbles and our TBM are in a very similar position. Bubbles are not good. It means that something is going wrong. If it's rotating on the ground, you could potentially damage the base of the tower. You could put all sorts of unwanted stresses into the tower. I'm really, really nervous. And people say to me, are you excited, Steve? And I said, no, it's more like it's just nervousness because you just don't want to let the team down and you want it to be absolutely brilliant for the people that sit in. If you're looking from the outside, there are no hiccups, no niggles or anything. It's like when you're on that passenger jet taking off. We've run out of runway now, so we're going to go. We're taking off. There's no going back now. Eight years in the making, finally here. It's a great day for all of us. This is now Australia's first driverless railway. Sydney's Super Tunnel, Wednesday nights on SBS.